YouTubers, it's Dolly Wolf. Um, I don't know if any of you are interested in earthquakes or seismic activity or not. Um, I am. And I wanted to show you something because this is kind of interesting. This is the Iris Seismic Monitor. And uh, you can see this at www.iris.edu. Um, this I mean, I know the USGS site also um, records earthquakes as well, so either one of the sites is good. Um, but basically, this is showing us the number of earthquakes that have occurred t today, yesterday, the past two weeks, and the last five years. The red <coughs> is today, orange is yesterday, and uh, the yellow is in the last past, the past, the last past two weeks. And as you can see, the whole ring of fire, uh, not just overseas, but over here in the Americas as well, and in the ocean, the whole place is just erupting in earthquakes. There's earthquakes all over the place. Russia, um, man, just everywhere. They're all over the frickin' place. I've never seen this many at one time. It's just bizarre. Um, I don't think it's anything to worry about, it, I just find it fascinating and interesting that there's so many all at one time. Now I don't expect you to read this, but this is a list of the earthquakes that were magnitude 4.0 or better, or higher, in the last 30 days. Now check this out. It just goes on, and on, and on, and on, and on. I just, I was like, wow! I mean, usually there's a bunch, but and this is a lot that are 4.0 or greater. Some of which are like 5, 6, 7. I was just like, holy crap! So this is very interesting. There was one uh, today in Indonesia that was a 7.4 on the Richter scale. But it's almost 300 miles deep. You know, the deeper the earthquake is, the less likely it is going to affect people on the surface. Okay, it's the ones that are under 100 miles deep that can rock the place a little bit. So that's why they didn't have any tsunami warnings or anything. But yeah, wow, hey, isn't that crazy?